is what's I see here and um I just kind of want to do I guess a, um I guess just a I guess vlog small talk and judging by the title it is yes going to be about learning to love yourself um especially since with everything lately that has been going on as you can tell I'm just kind of like in a big t-shirt and I'm wearing capris and I'm also sitting outside because it is a beautiful day or at least sitting outside at least because it's a beautiful day today or at least the filming of this video it's like 80 degrees out here in Virginia today and within a few days it's gonna be cold doesn't make sense and um, I'm actually not wearing sunglasses by the way I'm just wearing my actual glasses they're transition lenses so but um, anyways um, if you follow me on social media mostly um, Instagram you would see like how I look you know like especially if you go to my early like my early posts like towards the beginning you will see that I like I'm normally a small petite girl like I always have been and um like when I first moved up a little bit more up north of Virginia with my mom I was only about 80 pounds and then when I finished high school I was a little bit over 90 and now I am like about 105 let's say but um but if you watch, if you have been watching Molly Cyrus's um, daily, I guess, talk show vlogs that she's been doing, um, she did episode two with Demi Lovato and they talk about body shaming. And I think that is very, very, very important because especially all of us women, we shouldn't body shame each other. You know, no matter how much you weigh or like how you look, if you're you know big or small or whatever you know it's you know it doesn't matter you should love yourself the way that you are you know and the fact that so many people body shame each other it's like you know like I was really insecure about myself to be honest like for years because of the way that my body is and or at least me just naturally being small, you know? And I've always kind of, um... Sorry, there's just like a huge freaking bee by me. But, um, anyways, it's just kind of, um... You know, it, like, we shouldn't do that anymore. Women, you shouldn't do that anymore. Or just, you know, men in general, like, quit body shaming us. Like, it makes us so insecure and feel so much worse. Like, I didn't have, um, I didn't love myself for years. Like, you know, my family, and like, you know, other people have always told me, you know, that I look beautiful and stuff like that. That I've always looked beautiful and stuff like that, but, um, sorry, I'm just gonna move a little bit because there's, like, huge bees all over me. Sorry about that. <laughs> There's just like huge bees all like all over me. Anyways, um, this is like literally more of a vlog. I'm filming this with my phone, but um, hopefully this is better now. Um, anyways, um, you know, and her like in Miley and Demi talking about like Miley how she didn't love herself for years. You know, you shouldn't really she shouldn't have went she shouldn't have went through that and especially all that Demi has gone through but to come out stronger you know like I used to be so small like I'm actually like this now I used to be like you know skinny but now I am like I'm at the weight that I'm supposed to be and I feel so much more confident by myself 
like you shouldn't need I mean most women can't even look in the fucking mirror excuse my language can't even look in the fucking mirror and say that you love yourself because a lot of women don't but every day that goes by you have to feel at least proud of yourself like no matter what like you have to learn self-love and love yourself more than anything else in the world you know but um like my boyfriend I don't even know how I've been with my boyfriend for over three years now it'll be four in October um I only sometimes look back and I don't even know how he fell in love with me because I was really I was small but um but he saw much more than just how I looked and when I was young like I didn't start caring about how I looked until like middle school like late middle school I didn't care until then but um it's just it's crazy like and I used to not get teased but I have like I used to have like because I used to be skinny I have an Adam's apple and I used to get teased because I have an Adam's apple I don't even know if you can see it good anymore I me mean, maybe but I mean it's you know what I used to like hate it I mean I can't help it I mean it's just something genetic that I have and within my family line it's like like some members of my family actually have an ass and some don't you know shapes of ass you know it doesn't matter everybody's different but I inherited the way that I look partly um or at least my ass wise from my grandmother side like my mom doesn't have one or like you know not I guess flat I guess you can technically call it not trying to body shame anybody like my aunt has a huge ass mine is kind of like a medium and my grandmother when she was young she used to like my boyfriend saw a young picture of my grandmother and she was like whoa no wonder why but um my boyfriend has helped me learn to love myself no matter what and all of you guys should do the same to be honest because it's honestly crazy like seriously learn to love yourself like right now whether with whatever you're doing or like every morning look at yourself in the mirror and especially women now just say you are beautiful like I wake up most mornings and I look at myself whether it's in like while I'm getting dressed or while I'm brushing my teeth or fixing my hair I look at myself and I say I am beautiful you know even if it's like I have acne all over my face or I'm sick or you know doesn't matter just just learn self-love because that is seriously really important nowadays like it really is but um other than that just especially with this whole virus going around and everybody just going crazy I'm not gonna say too much but just have reliable sources and um, please take care of yourself and really care about personal hygiene because I like I'm kind of a germaphobic anyway so I and I try like take vitamins like take vitamins you know vitamin C like you know if if you have allergies you know take Benadryl and use nasal spray and you know for you know use excedrin or some type of headache medicine for headache if you get if it's your sinuses making you have a huge migraine and um, make sure you keep um, hand sanitizer on you like either as well a little travel sizes or just um, you know just something just make sure you wash your hands and if you're sick please stay home like not just because of what's going on but in general if you're sick then just stay home and just you know just pray and hope that hopefully it'll all go away soon because that's what I have been doing lately and my mom's kind of been freaking out like a lot about it like she's even gonna be ordering um or at least pick up from Walmart so that we don't have to go to the store but me and my boyfriend usually have to 
once a weekend, or at least for him, like, you know, for his dad and everything, so. But um, that's really all I wanted to say, just please, I'm not gonna go too much into this, so this video is not too long, but just please everyone, especially women, please just have self-love. Like seriously, just love yourself. Because that is so important to us women, and we shouldn't be body shaming each other anymore. Just love yourself, just smile. And I hope you guys stay safe and be careful. And um, I will see you guys in, in my next video. So bye.